look the nigga in the eye. Start a good shout. I looked the nigga in the eye. And I was like, damn. <laughs> Here we go. Is this the end? Ooh. Mama told me once that it was gonna happen. Nigga, you ain't finished the job. I was looking for you to finish the job. But I ain't gonna lie. When that bullet hit me, that burner kicked in. I said, woo. Ding my life kid. Woo. You're like, yeah, that, that little post I put up with the nigga from Blue Hill Ave. When he was dying, and he, he, when he hit that dope and it was killing him, he was, woo. Yeah, that part right there. That was me. Like, woo. -hoo -hoo. Yeah. Now, what I don't understand is, I'll tell y'all right now, what I, I swear to God, I don't understand this. I thought I stopped the live. I tried to stop the live a few times, but I couldn't, like, I left my book bag out there. Because y'all give me back my book bag, I pay for it. I want, Can I get my own, my, my camera stand and my book bag? Whoever got it, I won't hold you accountable. You can give it to somebody neutral. I, I cash out you. I'll give you some money for my book bag. I like that book bag. It's sentimental. Y'all give me back my book bag and y'all give me back my camera stand. I left that out there. You know, see me, I had to move because I didn't want Juju to get hit. That nigga came over there like on some real shit now. You know, because you got bitch ass niggas making videos. Talking about he stuck like he got a gun. He pulls out a cell phone. That nigga came outside because he heard me drunk, depressed, emotional. He said, this ain't highs right here. So he came over there, got on the phone, called up my niggas. They came too late. When he pulled up and he got there, he went out his way to get my attention because he seen the niggas coming. He saw them coming. He said, yo. So I look. You see me with the stupid look. I look down the hill. That was the two niggas down the hill. The camera seen it. <laughs> the police see it. So I'm not telling on nobody. It's all on camera. Right? They stood there. When we caught eye contact because they thought that trouble was going to back out and I was going to back out. So at that point, I was no I want y'all to understand something, right? When I saw the shooters, I want y'all to go back. Listen to what I'm saying. Go back and watch the video. When y'all see me looking down the hill, when you see trouble looking down the hill, that's when we caught eye contact with the shooters, right? From that point, I was nowhere near the camera to stop or edit. That shit was live. The FBI was watching that live. They paused it at that moment when them dudes pulled that gun. And then they turned the live back on when I was running to the car and jumped in the car. The reason why I got in the car is because when Trouble got out of the way, Checkmate got out of the way, he dipped one way. I grabbed my phone off of the tripod because I knew that this phone right here was connected to my YouTube. I couldn't let niggas get my phone. So I grabbed my phone, left the tripod, left the book back, jumped in the car, and then I had to bust a U-turn so I could put trouble in the car. Now, I ain't got time to get out and say you get in the driver's seat when I'm in pain. That shit hurt. That shit hurt. It was burning. It was hurting. It was like, first of all, you got to understand, son, when the bullet hit me, it traveled all the way from my shoulder to my back. So now I'm thinking to myself, okay, am I going to start swallowing? I'm coughing up blood. Because the last time I got shot, it did the same thing. But the only thing is the bullet went through my went through my own lungs and I was coughing up blood. So now, even though a nigga felt like, yo, I was on a suicide mission. I didn't want to make it out of Bronx Tripper. I was looking for them niggas to finish me. I was depressed. I wanted to go, I wanted to go be with my mother. Don't tell me my life is fake, like I staged. No, I was depressed. Y'all niggas done watched too many videos with the best moments of her song Campbell breaking down. The best moments. So don't let niggas sit up there and tell you, oh, this was a stage for attention because I don't have to stage nothing to get attention. Believe me. But just wait and see when I go back to Bronx River. Wait for that part. 